guys, Sadeh from Nastek, and today in this video, we'll be unboxing something special, uh, which is uh, Canon Evo 200 D2. So before that, if you're new to my channel, please make sure you press the subscribe button, hit the like button, and share the video as much as possible. So without any further ado, let's unbox this Canon Evo 200 D2. So this is the box packaging of the brand new Canon Evo 200 D2. You got to see the picture of the camera right over here. It's a brand new Canon uh, camera launched by Canon. It comes with the EFS 1855 IS STM kit lens. The scenario is that uh, the, basically the price of the camera is 50,000 rupees. But if you include like uh, EFS 55250 IS STM kit lens, it costs you 63,000 rupees. This is basically APS-C C format camera, which comes with a 24.1 megapixel SEMO sensor and IOS ranging from under to 25,600. Uh, which helps you to take uh, photos at uh, 5 frames per second. It has a crazy dual pixel autofocus mode, uh, like uh, autofocus works crazily. Connectivity, it has Wi-Fi and Bluetooth connectivity. Since it has Wi-Fi uh, connectivity, the photos and videos captured by this uh, can be easily uh, transferred to mobile phones or uh, laptops without any rendering issues. So this is why I call it a featured uh, packed DSLR camera. Here we go, let's unbox this uh, Canon 200D2. Okay, at first uh, there are some paperwork uh, which are quite common in all the products. The first thing we get to see is the user manual which is quite big, uh, which has complete info of the camera. Please do read it uh, for the efficient working of camera. And uh, uh, there is a warranty card uh, which comes with two years of warranty. It's quite interesting. Apart from that, uh, there is a photo complimentary photography session uh, given by Canon. Please do check them out. Let's keep them all aside and uh, see what's in the box. Let's take this out and see what's in the box. Oh, there are a lot of stuffs uh, feeling excited to unbox. So we have to go first. Uh, let's go with the smaller ones first. Firstly, they have given a 32 GB SD SD card, uh, which is uh, given free for the camera. It's cool. And uh, 1040 mAh. Uh, lithium and battery with a 7.2 volts uh, disk supply this is of uh, good quality moving on these two are the two squats for uh, like main squats for uh, charging the battery we should just have to place the battery right over here and charge it which are of both are of uh, good quality apart from that uh, they are given the next strap of uh, Canon company which comes with a red and uh, black combo which looks uh, good so now let's take out the EFS 1855mm IS STM kit lens which is right over here the product is uh, neat and uh, cleanly packed uh, which is uh, useful like which avoids uh, damage during transportation it's good it has an image stabilization mode which you can see here it can be uh, on or off uh, based on the your convenience uh, by this slide switch button it even has an auto focus mode and a manual focus mode which can be switched on or off uh, based on your convenience by this slide switch uh, this is the rear cap of the lens which can be open like this this is the front cap of the lens let's keep this aside the lens quality is uh, premium with the 1855mm lens and uh, which comes with a 4 to 4 to 5.6 aperture and it has a diameter of 58mm uh, uh, the lens quality is premium so let me show you the zooming capacity oh it feels very smooth so let's give this all aside and uh, see what's in the box now apart from that uh, here is uh, EFS 15-250 IS STM kit lens. Let's take this out first. The packaging is done pretty well. Oh, the product is packed and like it is neatly packed. Guys, basically this is the Canon zoom lens which has the same feature as of uh, this but in this case it works uh, more efficiently 
Uh, so let's see the zooming capacity. See guys, the zooming capacity is so huge. It's insane. This is the rear cap of the like uh, rear cap of the Canon now. Uh, lens. It has one is two four two five point six aperture with a fifty eight mm uh, diameter. Uh, the thing is that uh, you should have to pay extra ten thousand for this uh, lens. So now let's take out the camera first. The camera is neat and cleanly packed. Oh, let's keep this aside properly. So guys, this is the thing which we get to see in the box. Wow, the camera is beautiful. Uh, it, like it feels uh, great in my hand, and it's light in weight, uh, not that much heavy. Like it uh, weighs uh, 453 grams. Right over here, they have written EOS 200D2, and Canon branding logo is uh, placed right over here, which makes it look uh, cool. The built-in quality is uh, great. Have a look into that once. Let me see how the grip feels. The uh, grip feels good uh, because uh, they are given a rubber plating right over here, which prevents from slipping from the hand. Uh, this is a fully articulated touch screen. Let me open this. It can be flipped uh, as per your convenience, like uh, based on your needs, it can be flipped. Uh, this this feature is quite interesting. The body of the camera is made up of high quality plastic which doesn't look cheap in any of the angle which you can see here. Talking about the parts on the right side part of the camera they are given HDMI out and a USB port which you can see and on the bottom part they are given a tripod mount right over here there is a HDM like HD card slot and a battery slot. Here you should have to insert uh, SD card right? and here you should have to insert the battery. On the left side part, uh, they are given a remote control center and an external mic port. Now I have connected the lens to the camera. Yeah, it's a bit heavy, but it does its job done. Like uh, it helps us to take the good clarity photos or videos. Moving on to the buttons, this is called shutter button, which is used to click the photos or videos. And this is called um, main, main dial, which is made up of metal. And this is called, and there are ISO display button, which is right over here. And there is a lot of mode on the dial uh, pad, like you can use it according to your convenience. And there is on off or a movie mode which is controlled by this button. And the strap order are placed on the either side of the camera, are placed in a good position. And other than that, uh, there is a shutter mount which is used to connect the camera with mic or uh, flash. And this is the camera flash, it's the, like it's inbuilt flash. Here they are given the speaker which even access the Wi-Fi indicator like uh, when the camera connected to the Wi-Fi uh, the light blinks right over here. Uh, here they are given the menu and info button. Uh, here there is a delete button and this is called a preview button. Uh, let's move on to the display now. Let me open this first. As I said earlier uh, it is a fully articulated display. Let's see how the display works. Yeah, the display works uh, pretty good. Uh, there is no issues uh, while working with it. So overall, the building quality is super cool. It fits uh, really nice to my hand. Uh, like there is no slippery. So if you are planning to buy this camera, just go for it. My suggestion is that if you are a photographer or a video logger, like if you shoot videos for log, I suggest you not to buy this lens. Uh, this lens does it uh, job very well. So that's all for the video, guys. Hope you liked it. Please do like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Thank you. I have a fruitful day. Stay safe. Stay healthy.